meteorologist Chelsea Chandler with the Mid-South Certified Most Accurate Forecast. All right, well, you can see there's still a lot going on, but not a whole lot here at the moment. Most of the moisture trapped uh, behind that or in front of that cold front, as you can see, uh, as Nicholas just still kind of carries on through Louisiana, bringing them more rain they don't need. But unless you're flying today and flying through Atlanta or Charlotte in the early morning hours, you should be fine, maybe a little bumpy. But other than that, not seeing too much trouble. So let's take a look, though, at uh, what's going on. Look at a beautiful sunrise coming up. We still have a few clouds, but it's not too bad. This is I-40 towards downtown Memphis. Here's what it feels like outside right now. 70 degrees is the actual temperature. Again, uh, partly cloudy skies. It feels like 70 because our dew point is 70, uh, 68, but that is very close to having very saturated air, which can produce fog, which is why we are seeing some visibility concerns in some areas starting to get pretty bad actually just outside of our area. So they'll probably end up with a fog advisory soon. But a mile of visibility in Jackson and Dyersburg, two in Somerville, nine in Memphis. So that's fine. As long as your 10 is perfect, as long as you're at seven or above, you're okay. Six in Clarksdale. Again, I uh, want to keep your low beams on. If high beams reflect back off of the fog and make it even worse. So throughout the day, you want your sunglasses, you want your rain gear later on. We have rain chances really between about four until about maybe uh, 6 37 o'clock tonight. So any plans you have, whether it's kicks on Beale, bark in the park that's outside, it's okay. It's, it should rain before it, um, but otherwise temperatures in the 80s and not too bad. So we'll keep an eye on it and keep you up to date with the latest.